How's it going, guys? My name is TJP, and welcome back to another EA Sports FC 24 franchise winning challenge with our next team here, the Chicago Fire FC Eastern Conference. Leave a like, subscribe, and join the content. Comment down below this video. Your socials play the second channel and main channel down in the description if you do like other content from me, TJP. Three seasons should have wide a win and MLS Cup and injuries, all that fun stuff's on. It's not meant to be realistic, and if we mispronounced some names, we mispronounced some names. With that all being said, let's get on to the gameplay. Let's take a look at the squad hub here. So we'll look at it from overall perspective. So Shakir's our best player. We've got Chizzo, Socat, Dubio's on loan. We've got Jimenez, Kamara, Navarro, Muller, Prisvilko, Torres, Seves, uh, Gutierrez. We've got Brady, Pineda, Tehran, Kutsias, Richie, Herbers, Navarro. We've got Gall. we got Wyatt on the team. Kendall Burks, Alex Monis, Jonathan Dean, Victor Berzera, Justin Reynolds, Sergio Orgel, and then Michelle Rodriguez and Javier Casas Jr. So we got some guys that need to be extended on those contracts. So we'll um, have to obviously, you know, at some point, not right this moment, but we will have to extend some of these guys since they're expiring. Most of the guys are happy right now with the contract, so totally fine with that. Let's take a look here at the uh, Youth Academy, see if we have anybody good that we could maybe call up. Right now, nobody that is, uh, you know, tickling my, uh, tickling my tummy. So totally fine there. Uh, if we take a look at the team strategy, team sheets, all that fun stuff. As we can see, we've got uh, one sheet right here. I'm going to make some adjustments here. Put uh, Kamara in there. CC's so pretty good. So, Ket right back. Uh, we've got ourselves um, a set as he could be our left back. Gutierrez, left mid. I think that's fine. Right mid, we'll have Halle Selassie. Works for me. And then everybody else here seems to be okay. Uh, actually, Muller will be our left mid. Sorry, not Gutierrez. So we'll do this instead. So Gutierrez, you can come on in. We'll put in um, Torres. Navarro could be a backup left back. And I think that's fine. And then you can go here. Uh, we could try to get a center back, I'd say. Uh, there's a couple of guys that we could maybe look for in the market. So I think we'll do that. We'll save our change to the team sheet. And I think that's good. So we're going to, you know, look around, see what's out there in the transfer market, try to improve this team going forward. And then, yeah, we should be able to uh, be pretty solid. Let's take a look at the objectives that team wants us to do. So as you guys can see, nothing too crazy. Uh and after player sales money rewards all right yeah, i think we can i think we can uh i think we should be pretty solid uh so yeah let's um adjust this training plan make sure everybody is on performing performance focused so we'll do that apply to all players and we should be good so yeah let's take a look here at the transfer market so you can add some more talent to the team and then uh, go on from there all right, so we're getting uh, Rodrigo Abascal uh, from Boa Vista FC. Now, we paid his release clause, so we definitely overpaid for him, uh, but he is a solid overall. Um, so, yeah, should be pretty good there. I'm happy with that. He's a solid squad player. Shout us out. Try to get Abada. They're thinking about it. We'll see if we can get him on the team, too. But that'd be nice to add a talent of uh, his caliber. Right, so, I think I'm going to be overpaying here for Abada, but let's see if we can kind of get him on the team. Uh, we'll see if we can get him. I mean, he's a good player, so it's not like I'm mad about getting a good player on my team, but uh, we're going to try to negotiate a contract here with him. Did get um, a bot now. We transferred out Gutierrez, $3.65 million, um, which is whatever. Uh, we got a bot coming on the team. We might have overpaid a little bit for him. Uh, we definitely did, but um, he is a you know good player, so good squad player should help us out. Uh, for this upcoming season. We've been doing the Asian Elite Cup here. Now, I'm going to just double-check the um, training plans. We're going to put those on balanced, I think, because um, I think everyone is at full form. So we're going to go uh, balanced on all the starting 11 just to make sure that they are not um, dying. Um, so, yeah, we're going to see how well we do in this Asian Elite Cup just to get us prepped up for the season. And uh, moment of truth here. Let's see how we do. First game here, neutral friendly. We're going to get the W, 3-1. to one. Second game, we get the W, 1-0. Third game, we draw, uh, which is fine. Uh, didn't win the Elite uh, Cup, though, unfortunately. But, you know, we got ourselves 
in tip-top shape, so I can't be too mad about that. Let's uh, head on to the regular season. Hopefully this team could be pretty good. I'll let you guys know once I have an update for you. So we got ourselves a Max Aarons from Bournemouth uh, for 6.3. I mean, not a terrible deal. I mean, decent price for him. Uh, and he's going to help out our squad. Uh, so I'm pretty happy with that. Welcome to Team Max Aarons. So we're in the uh, middle of the season right now. I mean, we're not doing too great. Uh, we're sitting at... Uh, 13th 22 points don't think we're gonna make the playoffs but it's fine for now let's take a look at the uh squad hub here so see how the team is doing statistically so our leading goal getter has been Muller with seven we got six from kamara there's bilka was five we got four from shakiri and torres in terms of assists five from menez four from soket uh or so k and then we got clean sheets right there so i mean it's not doing we're not doing all we're not doing too bad there's some talent on the team I'm hoping that, um, you know, like I said, this uh, upcoming season that we're able to uh, accomplish what we need to accomplish. I'm just taking a look at the contracts here. Just taking a look and see what we got going on. Uh, we got some guys, like I said, that are on loan um, for our team. Uh, so, yeah, we'll see what ends up happening uh, with the squad. And um, hopefully uh, we can maybe add a, maybe another player or two with the squad. If not... Uh, just continue to kind of keep the board relatively reasonably happy so we can get on to the second season and then try to make some improvements next year. So we didn't have a great season. Um, we ended with 33 points. I'm not sure if the board is going to be super duper happy, um, but we'll see. Uh, let's take a look at the squad hub. Uh, and if we look at stats, we've got... 10 goals from Muller, Kamara with 8, 7 from Pizbilko, Shakira with 6, 4 from Torres. You can see the assist leader, Smenez at 8, 4 from Soke. Uh, it kind of just goes down from there. You got clean sheet leaders, Muller with 6, 5 from Aceves. Uh, a few of these guys are going to end up transferred out, which is, you know, it is what it is. I don't know why Leo Liel Abada only played one, two games. Doesn't really make any sense to me, but, you know, my literally my team sheets say that he's supposed to be starting, but I, I, I don't understand. Um, regardless, um, let's... Uh, Hope that we don't get fired and uh, have another season to try to build upon uh, what we've got going on. Because, like I said, we can try to get some more transfer guys in the market and uh, see what we can do going on from there. Season is here. And um, we ended up, uh, you know, finishing 10th, 41 points. I mean, not terrible, but obviously not good enough to make the playoffs. Let's take a look at the squad hub and see what we got going on here. So if we take a look at the stats, as you can see... 14 goals for Muller, Kamara with 9, Chris Wilk with 7, 7 from Shakiri, Torres with 4, uh, Sicily, we've got 5 from Soke, Man with 5 as well, 4 from Herbers and Shakiri, 3 from Spilko, 2 from Muller and Kamara, got your clean sheet leader, 6 there, 5 from Soke, Aceves with 5, a bunch of guys with 5, a bunch of guys with 4, and it just goes on from there, so, um, yeah, I mean, obviously, got a couple seasons left, uh, I think second season, we'll try to find some improvement to the team, hopefully, we can uh, make a couple transfers, get some more talent on the squad. That's the goal. Uh, let's uh, simulate the rest of the uh, offseason or rest of the playoffs and see who ends up winning them a cup and then uh, go on to the next season. The season, Chicago is going to give me another chance here. Uh, I wanted to see who won the MLS Cup, and I did not see who ended up winning the MLS Cup. Not that it really matters, um, but it's fine. All right, so we're going on to the second season. We'll try to see if we make improvement to this team. Going forward, uh, hopefully we can uh, get our squad back into order. Overall, so we got, um, we've got Abada, we've got Shakiri, Max Ahrens, uh, Abascal, uh, we've got Soket, uh, Soket, we've got uh, Menez, uh, Rafael's on the squad, we've got Aceves here, Torres, Muller, Brady, Spielko, Kamara still on the team. Uh, Richie, although he's getting transferred out. Yeah, these guys, some of these guys are going to get transferred out. Richie, Herbers, Gal, Almsberg, Burks, Monas, Bezerra, Dean, Reynolds, Hancock, Origel, Rodriguez, Cuts Jr., and then uh, Diakov. So those are the guys. I mean, obviously, there's some guys that are going to be expiring on contracts, so we'll try to renew those at some point. Get that under the way. We'll also try to add some more talent to the team. Got to double check the objectives this season just to make sure that these guys don't uh, stay up on my back. Obviously, so um, so far, I guess we're somewhat reasonable within two seasons. One youth player, at least 30% of the games. 
don't know if that's gonna happen. 10 games without a defeat. Okay. I don't know what that means. Reach the quarterfinal, reach around the 16 stage. Okay, so nothing too crazy. Uh, cool. Let's uh, see what ends up happening here. Try to get some uh, more talent on the team and uh, have a good season. All right, so we got ourselves Andrea Bellotti uh, from Roma FC, a $12.6 million transfer. That's not too bad. I feel like we got him on a pretty solid price, and he is going to be a 78 overall. Should be super helpful in our lineup. I uh, love that there. All right, so I'm going to be doing the European International to get ourselves uh, warmed up for the season. Uh, we'll see how we could do. I mean, if we could win it, that'd be awesome, but I don't think we will. Uh, first game is a 2-1 loss, and so we already lost it. Draw and a win. Okay, I mean, it's, hey, that's fine. Got ourselves warmed up for the season, so I can't be mad about that. Uh, but yeah, we'll see how this team does uh, this upcoming season. Hopefully, we're pretty good, and uh, we'll uh, go on from there. So... We were doing well, but then we started losing a bunch of games. Uh, a couple injuries happened. But we're sitting at 26 points. I mean, I guess it's possible for us to turn it around, but we need a bunch. Of, we need a bunch of things to go our way. Uh, so we'll see how we can fare. But let's take a look at the squad hub right now and see what's happening. Um, so if we take a look at stats, some goals: 11 from Bellotti, seven from Herbers, Muller with five, three from Abasco, Shakiri. A couple guys here: Aaron's and Monus. In terms of assists. Shakir with seven, five from Menez, four, five from Herbers, Aaron's with two, a bunch of guys with one, you got your clean sheets right there, so, I mean, there's, there's some players that are doing pretty solid, I think I want to try to get, um, you know, a couple additional players on the transfer up, so we're going to look around and see what's out there in the market, um, and yeah, we'll kind of go on from there, I guess. And ourselves another transfer here, so we're getting Dota Gundo from Tottenham. 4 million on a transfer fee. I feel like we got him on a pretty solid price and he should be able to help us out uh, tremendously at that left back position. All right, so we're getting ourselves Miguel Aziz from Arsenal coming to our team on a $2.1 million transfer fee. Uh, I feel like that's a pretty solid player to have on our squad. Good squad player. Got him on a good price. We're going to try to uh, adjust the lineups and uh, go on from there. All right, so unfortunately, once again, another season where we didn't make the playoffs. Um, uh, we ended up in 11th. Um, bit of a disappointing year, um, but we got one more season to go, so maybe we could try to turn it around next season. Take a look at the squad hub and see what we got going on. So if we look at the stats, most goals on the team, 16 from Bellotti, Herbert's with 12. Got a bunch of guys here doing their thing out there. In terms of assists, you guys can see the leader, Shakira with 10, 7 from Herbert's, men with 6. Then it kind of dips going down, and you got your clean sheets, a bunch of guys at seven. Uh, and again, you guys can pause and take a look or slow down the video if you guys really want to see. Um, nothing too crazy. So I'm hoping third and final season we can maybe turn this thing around. Got to make sure that these guys just stop complaining. All they do is complain. Uh, so anyways, uh, we're going to go to the squad hub. I want to see what we have happening here financials uh is anybody here expiring menes is but i can't get him back uh shakiri's expiring can't get him bloody we can contract renew him and um well i mean we'll throw him we'll throw him 25 and then we'll go don't go higher than 38 nah, that's too low Ah, shoot. Okay, well, that's not good. Um, I probably should have given him, like, 50. It is what it is. Um, all right, we're going to keep going, see what happens, and I will see you guys at the, uh, you know, end of the offseason. Hopefully, we're uh, staying on the team for one more year. All right, so the um, – what? who ended up winning the uh, cup? Let's see. Take a look at the standings. New England. Nice. All right, let's head on to the next season because I think we are going to keep our job. It's um, pretty interesting. Here's the squad. We've got Aaron, Shakiri, Abasco, Guindo, Jimenez, Jimenez, Muller, Brady, uh, Prisbielko, Aziz, Herbers, Gal, Richie, Almsberg, Burks. We got Bezerra on loan uh, to a different team. Monas Dean, Reynolds, Hancock, Virgil, Rodriguez, Casas Jr., 
Cruz, and Diakov are the guys that we've got. So that is the team that we're currently at right now. Now, I am going to try to see what the story is here with Shakiri and uh, Menez. They might be gone. I, I don't know. Uh, so we'll see what happens. Uh, we'll try to add some more talent on the team. That is for sure. And uh, we will uh, hope for a good season, try to make a run for our playoffs this, this year. Big transfer here for Brendan Aronson coming from Leeds to Chicago. I uh, feel like that's going to be a pretty good player to add on our team. Uh, we got him on a good deal. 70, you know, 80 overall, actually, is what they say. He's a star player, so welcome to the squad, my man. All right, so we're going to be doing the Asian Elite Cup. Uh, might as well just do the cup that gives us the most money. I mean, right? So we'll see how we fare. Again, this is just to get us ready for the regular season. First game we lose, so we're already not going to win the cup. Lose again, and we lose again. Oh, we actually won. Okay, I thought we were going to lose. So there you go. We didn't do great, but that's fine. I'm all worried about the um, regular season anyway. So hopefully we can get that cup. That's the goal halfway through the season right now and i mean we're sitting at ninth we're close to being able to make the playoffs here so let's take a look at the squad hub and just see the stats so far on the season in case you guys are curious so if we look at them you got your leading goal scorers aaron's with nine prezioke with nine you got herbers moeller origel up there max aaron's up there with two we got your assist leaders prezioke with seven so he's doing really well he's got eight clean sheets as well which looks like that leads the team. So the team's been doing okay. We're right in that running for that uh, for a playoff spot. So hopefully we can maybe make the playoffs. It'd be nice to end the season off, uh, third and final season. So let's see what happens. Uh, if I decide to make a transfer, I'll let you guys know. But I think I might just keep the team as is. We'll see. And, uh, this is the end of the season, and we did not make the playoffs. So uh, tried our best, but unfortunately finished 11th. We were close. But not close enough. So we couldn't get over the hump. We were we just need we needed to win a few more games. And if we would have won a few more games, we'd have a shot to get that seven spot. But we slipped out. Uh, we needed to have a really good start of the season. Unfortunately, we didn't do that. So we did not make the playoffs here in any of the seasons, unfortunately. Uh, but you know, I feel like we had a solid team. It's just like you know, it just didn't work out. Aronson, Spielko with double figure goal scoring. You got your assist leaders, Spielko with eight. If you guys with three, if you guys with two, you got your clean sheets. Eight from Herbers, Prisvioka with eight, a bunch of guys with seven, a bunch of guys with six. So, um, I obviously I'm gonna get fired, but whoever wins the uh, cup wins the cup, um, which would be super awesome. And yeah, uh, I guess this is pretty much it. I mean, I'll see if I get fired officially, but if I don't, I'll let you guys know who wins the cup, and then we'll go on to uh, close out the video. All right, so I did get fired, obviously. Makes sense. They didn't like the way I was doing things. Totally fine. Not a big deal. I kind of wanted to see who was going to be the uh, winner of the MLS Cup. Don't know if I could see that. Um, or do I have to wait until the... Let me see here. What is the... Yeah, okay. End of the season. Season's coming to an end, so... We'll, we'll see who ends up winning the cup, and then we'll uh, close out the video. All right, so it looks like Minnesota won the cup. Yep, Minnesota won the cup on penalties against the Red Bulls. I guess with that all being said, full screen to close out the video. All right, guys, we'll hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like and subscribe. Comment down below this video. If you have our socials, play the second channel, main channel down in the description. If you like the content of DJP. Um, again, we'll try to continue sparingly put these out as best as we can. Uh, we'll look at the MLS standings here. So, and that was the Easter Conference The Chicago was. So the Western Conference team, I guess theoretically the next one would be Austin. So, yeah, I guess with that being said, whenever I put that out, I put it out, and I'm going to head on out. Take care, everybody. We'll see you soon. Peace.